in terms of technical assistance, one of the things that's really interesting is seeing how the store owner prices things. You know, it's very erratic. There's no system. Oftentimes, when working in small mom pop stores, is they don't price and label their products consistently. Um, that's something that I think is extremely important because you know, for the most part, it's very rare that you'll go to a supermarket and you won't see a price or a label. And so that's what the average consumer is expecting. So if you go to a store, you don't see that. Right off the bat, you're going to be suspect. In retail, there's a very specific system that you need to follow. You know, maybe it's a 33% margin, maybe it's a 40% margin, but you know that each item in a store is priced a certain way for a reason. You know, and it's typically if you go to any supermarket and you notice when you're shopping, maybe the general, maybe the everyday average uh, customer doesn't understand this, but milk and bananas, there's kind of an expected price. You know, if you go to a store, if you're paying more than $3.99 for a gallon of milk, you're offended or irritated or just can't believe it. And in all actuality, that, that's a very low margin. Oftentimes in the dairy retail specifically, you only make about 10%. And then you have to be able to recoup that in another area in your store, you know. And so there, there is a formula to be followed. A lot of these retailers and small mom pop stores have no idea about those formulas because they're just, they've either bought this store and they're from another country or they've started this store and it's a new business and they don't know what they're doing. But there is like a lot of retail models in place to follow, you know, and to, you know, to emulate. And that is part of the process is really helping them to see what other stores that are successful, what they are doing to make them successful. It's not just their location, it's not just that their resources, there's also a very specific retail formula that they're following as far as placement and cost.